Julia Bradbury took to Instagram to share a despondent-looking selfie with her 250,000 followers, warning that nobody really knows what's going on behind the reels, just a day after marking the one-year anniversary of her cancer surgery. The 53-year-old former countryfile presenter was diagnosed with breast cancer in 2021, and went on to have a mastectomy when one of her breasts and two lymph glands were removed to prevent the spread of the disease. Although she has since proudly declared that she is safely in remission, the last few years have been a struggle for her, and she wanted to lay her pain bare. Labeling her picture with the question, Insta happy or Insta sad, she insisted, nobody really knows what's going on behind the reels on here. Him having as asterisk 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 time right now, and that's just the way it is. She continued, mostly I try to post hopeful, useful or funny content. But sometimes it feels right to share reality. Insta real. If you're having a bit of a tough time at the moment share it on here if it makes you feel better. She then concluded with a quote by American poet and civil rights activist Maya Angelou, urging fans, try to be a rainbow in someone's cloud. Julia had previously admitted that her cancer diagnosis had prompted her to re-examine my entire lifestyle. The presenter, who shares three much-loved children with husband Gerard Cunningham, added yesterday on her Instagram stories that the cancer had come as a shock to her, as her only symptom had been breast tenderness, and she hadn't felt a lump. She explained, I didn't have a lump. The mammogram did not show it. But the ultrasound and MRI did. Though she might have been experiencing the blues, she was soon inundated with support from her Instagram devotees. 1. At Denis Ocon, mirrored Julia's decision to publish a quote, writing, Courage doesn't always roar. Sometimes courage is the little voice at the end of the day that says I will try again tomorrow, Mary Ann Radmarker. At Hannabella underscore Nell added, I heard a lovely saying recently, to think of the ups and downs as a needle and thread weaving up and down through the fabric of yourself, pulling you back together xxx be gentle with yourself lovely one xx. At Amanda Winwood praised Julia for her honesty, coming in contrast to some Instagram accounts, which show off only the perfect times in life. Huge thanks to you for posting this. What it does is allow other people to be real as well. And you're as real as it gets, she exclaimed. Even the grooviest, most outgoing, resilient and kind people are allowed to have less than brilliant times. And for the record you're still BL asterisk asterisk why lovely even though you're not having the best time. Sending a huge hug, at ladyl underscore 41 chimed in, I really think it is okay to be sad sometimes. We need to be able to talk about the bad days and the good days. Not everything can be positive all the time. Life isn't like that. Sending love. Meanwhile, at Stephen Kenny 56 courageously shared a story of his own wife's cancer battle, before urging Julia, spring is around the corner, so hang in there.